Yep, that's copper. Show you what I'm working with here. We got a tree that's that's down here behind me. Maybe what 40, 50 years old. And what we found underneath is what's really catching our eyes because uh, well here check this out metal detector these are really handy I don't know what's in there but we're hoping to find some more of whatever was in there Jason, turn the camera off. I found a bunch of gold. <laughs> yeah, I wish. But as you see here, we got big boulders, big rocks all up in here. And uh, hopefully we can find some more copper. Or gold, silver. Well, this is actually pretty cool here. That rock that I had split before we had been digging to them. It doesn't come down out of there and break a kneecap. I can just stand right there and that. I'd have to say that rock there is pretty wedged in there. That one too. So we'll work down in here and try to get down along here. Yeah, so I've been working down to this rock, and I noticed it was uh, kind of green again. Let's see if I can, there it is. Well, it's got to have what? At least what, copper or gold, one of the two in here. Yeah. Let's see if I can pull it up out of here. Tell you one thing, it's heavy rock. It's green. Good find, Jason. Good find. Another one, you know. We'll put that over here with the other one that I found. And it's going to suck having to carry that thing out, but. It's going to pay me 100 bucks an hour. <laughs> Pull as material out of here as I can and drop it through the uh, through the um, detector. I'm sure you're probably uh, wondering where I am right now, and uh, I can guarantee I'm going to edit this video, so you have no idea where we are. Besides, why would I want to tell you where there might be precious metals in the ground? I found something finally. You found something finally? on you for a little bit and see if you can't yeah could have been your shovel there I'd be careful yeah, could be. It's a big, big rock, man. It probably weighs as much as you. Oh, I'll keep working. Back in the hole. Back in the hole, back in the hole. Marvin's probably getting pretty mad at me right now, but I just found another piece. Heavy.
I can't wait to clean this piece up. But it was right here, wedged behind this, and we kept detecting it. When the tree went up, this part here would have been down here somewhere. Probably back here behind me, actually. So this really would have been down in this hole right here, around all this rock. So, yeah. I think this is pretty interesting. I think we should start uh, tearing apart up here maybe and work our way back down. Getting dark, I guess we'll be headed back to the house here soon and uh, we'll be coming back to this spot uh, pretty quick. I wish I could show you again where we are, but there ain't a chance in heck. So I hope you guys like this little quick video of uh, hunting for copper in Upper Michigan. It was just a couple of weeks ago that I found another piece in this very spot. That's why we're back here checking. And uh, you'll probably see it right here. So this is the piece of copper that I found um, quite a few weeks back. So yeah, I'm not really sure about these big rocks. Um, just look at this one. It's got some very nice colors to it. It's got this crack that's running through here. I'm kind of very interested to see what is in there. Um, this one as well, I, it's flat. Got some nice lines going through there. Again, I don't know what it is that's uh, is setting off the middle detector on these. Same thing with this one. I just weighed these rocks. This one weighs about 11, 12 pounds. This one weighs about 14 pounds. Uh, these are not enough to even weigh on my scale. But this one here, oh, that's the big heavy one. I'm not really sure if this is a quartz line that's running through there. Or what that is, but... And this is the other beauty that I found. Look at that. That is... Upon looking at this closer, I think this black, darker material are rocks. And that is actual piece of copper. Copper found in Dickinson County. Is that just crazy or what? This is a MD-300 metal detector. And give you a little up. Well, already hitting on it. Hold on, let me get this other metal away, just so we know it's not hitting on anything else. This one here. And this big old thing. There it goes. And these two are obviously copper just by looking at them. You know, you have to get near them and they're hitting off on them. found in Dickinson County. Isn't that just crazy or what? Thanks for watching everybody. If you like what you just saw, give me that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and uh, make a comment below. I wanna hear what you guys think. Where have you found copper in the UP? And uh, where should I go look?